Hi everyone, in this video I wanted to point out a feature that you will find in the My IT Lab uh, simulation training and I believe in the simulation exam. Um, there's a feature over here on the, um, the uh, kind of the ribbon question area and it's called the launch on-screen keyboard button. So if you click on that you'll see that you get a Windows keyboard and I'll show you in just a second how to use that so if there's something either if you're a Mac user and it's calling for some type of keyboard shortcut that um, is more difficult for you on your um, keyboard um, or if maybe you're working on a laptop and like maybe the function keys aren't working or something you can always use this on-screen keyboard so, um, first what I have to do here is I have to make some new columns. So I will select those, click insert, and I have my two columns, and then they want me to do some flash fill here. <clears throat> make sure I put it in correctly. I'm using a little check mark just to stay within that box, and then I'm going to come over here and use flash fill. Okay, so I did that piece. Now it says use the flash fill keyboard shortcut to enter the categories which begin with oak and column D beginning with D11. So I'll come over here to D11. I'm typing in the word oak. Again, I'll just use the check mark so that I can stay, complete my entry but stay within that cell. Now they want me to do the flash fill um, keyboard shortcut. So if I come to over here and put my mouse pointer on it, I can see that the um, keyboard shortcut is Control and then E. So I can use that um, on-screen keyboard. And so how I would do it is I would click the Control key and then the E key and see how it adds them together. And then when I'm all done with the sequence, then I'll click the word Go. And it took care of that for me. And now it says to delete column B because we finished all that. Okay, good. So now I'm on to the next question. So um, if you're having a little bit of a difficulty with the My IT Lab and some of the um, keyboard sequences, this might be something that you can uh, use that will just make things um, a little bit easier. So I hope that that's been helpful. And again, it's right over here on in the question area to the right hand side, or sometimes you're uh, question areas on kind of along the um, column of your screen instead of at the bottom but you'll see it it says keyboard there so you can use certainly use the keyboard if you need to okay alrighty so again hope it was helpful take care